92.7 WOBM, Wednesday morning, May 20th, 739, 57 degrees. Joining us right now, the Director of Media Relations with the Lakewood Blue Claws, Greg Jambarisi is with us this morning. He's also faves. the voice of your beloved Lakewood Blue oh, Claws yes. as well. Greg, good morning. Thanks for getting up with us. Yeah, no problem, guys. Good morning. How are you? Hi, Greg. How are you doing today? Doing well in, uh, in Salisbury, Maryland. One more day here, and then uh, we'll head home tomorrow, uh, after the game today. All yes, right. and that's what we want to talk to you about. It is a big weekend coming up. Back home for the Blue Claws. Tell us about everything that's going on with the big holiday weekend with the Blue Claws. Yeah, Memorial Day weekend is always a good one. That's the ballpark kind of our uh, unofficial start of summer, and um, we have a, a big weekend planned. Home Thursday night to start. Friday night we have fireworks. We're doing a special uh, David Letterman appreciation night. Because tonight's his last show, so we're going to kind of turn the ballpark into the uh, Ed Sullivan Theater, I guess, on, uh, on Friday. So it'll be a lot of fun. Uh, that's one we've been working on for about six, seven months now. Um, Four or five games Saturday, and then Sunday night, again, uh, fireworks and kids be free and kids run the bases. And then a four or five game on Monday for Memorial Day too. So we got a lot of stuff uh, planned over the whole weekend. It's going to be a lot of fun. It looks like good weather too uh, for everything, yeah. Greg. Looks like it's going to be some nice weather. I saw great. that. Uh, the, I try not to look too far ahead. <laughs> yes, <laughs> you know, it changed so much. But I did look yesterday, and it does look like it's going to be really good weather. So uh, we're looking forward to what should be a, a lot of fun, uh, a big weekend this weekend. There's no better way to, I guess, kick off summer than at the ballpark at the first energy party. I love it, Greg. It's going to be a great weekend. I got to be honest with you, boy. The sound of a hot dog and a nice cold beer just sounds good to me. I mean, I just, uh, you know, I'm going to try to scoot over there if I can. Now, you guys have uh, an early game today, right? If I'm correct. Yeah, ten thirty-five in uh, Salisbury against oh, okay. Delmarva. Yeah, oh. is that the earliest you've ever started? I mean, has there ever been an earlier start than that? Or well, what's the a... businessman special? Well, you see that? Yeah, they bring all the kids out, so it'll be filled with uh, with school uh, with students from all over the area. So I love it. Um, every team does it a little differently. When we do them in Lakewood, we have one next Wednesday. Um, they're at eleven oh five. These guys down here do it at ten thirty-five. The earliest I've seen it and we've had is ten oh five. Wow. 10.05 is pushing it. 11.05 is nice. 10.35, okay. 10.05 is pushing it a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we get that call. Hey, Greg, we got an 8 o'clock game. Oh, uh, my word. Uh, but, yeah. uh, <laughs> so it's going to be a lot of fun. Give us a quick update. Where are Blue Claws at here as far as how they're doing this season? You know, it's a young season, but how are things going for the Blue Claws? Uh, a uh, couple games under 500, but doing pretty well. Have uh, two of the 10 leading hitters in the in the league, the center, our center fielder, Carlos Tochi, who's back with us again, um, he leads the league in hitting at 356, and he also is third in the league in on-base percentage, and he's just 19. He's actually in his third stint with the Blue Claws, but he's only 19 years old, so um, he's playing really well. So it's uh, off to a pretty good start, though. Obviously, a long way to go. All right, very good, very good. Uh, real quick, before we wrap it up, because we know you want to get some breakfast and get going here, uh, <laughs> you've got an early start, but this is real early for you. Uh, last night, you had an unexpected guest in the broadcast booth with you. I heard about this. <laughs> that, has that ever happened to you oh, before? No. So what happened was uh, a, we had a bird, and the, the stadium here, there are a lot of birds. I don't know why, but there are a lot of birds. And oh, no. the press box has these big, like, eight-foot-high windows. Yeah, and there are no there are no blinds, so it, it looks like if you're on the second level of the press box and you're looking out, it just looks like there's nothing there. Mm. So this poor bird um, flew in uh, or flew from the second level. I don't know how he got in, but he flew from the second level, thinking he was going out, and he hit the window, and it kind of shocked him, and he fell down right onto the uh, our broadcast location. It kind of spooked me a little bit, oh. but um, yeah, so they, they took him down stairs and outside and they said he was going to be okay but he was just a little shocked uh that he hit the window so it was going to take him a little while to kind of as were you when the bird dropped onto (laughs) your broadcast (laughs) table there did he you know right onto your 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 prep work there you're trying to figure out who's at bat and there's the bird so (laughs) there's the bird (laughs) all right yeah so um yeah but they said he was going to be okay but it was a little uh, a little scary there for him all right well, that's something. That, see, that's with the stories, okay. Sue. You can add to the stories of broadcasting <laughs> baseball. Uh, always that a fun is time. scary, though. Greg, thanks for being with us. Folks can tune in to 1160 WOBM AM today for the game. Begins at 1035, and Greg will be on there with the play-by-play. Today, have a great day and a good, safe trip back to Lakewood. Thanks, Sean and Sue. We'll see you this weekend. Thanks, All right, Greg. see you there. There he is, Greg J.M. Barisi, the um, Director of Media Relations and the voice, Sue of our very own Lakewood Blue Claws Mm -hmm. and a, a fond lover of birds as well.
We'll be back. More coming up. Head out to the ballpark this weekend for a lot of fun with WOBM. The Ocean County Breakfast Show with Shawn Michaels and Sue Mall. Ocean County's Breakfast.